can't actually remember the last time we ended up out out. You know what I mean by this, don't you? The fact that in the UK we drink so much, we have different levels of being out, different types. I'll talk you through them. You pop out just to go to the shops, you've got to get a couple of bits, and you bump into a friend who says, should we have a quick drink? And you go, yeah, only a quick one, though, because I'm very busy. <laughs> Three hours later, you're still in the pub. <laughs> and then what happens is the evening people come in. These people are going out properly. These people are going what we like to call out-out. <laughs> now, the out-out people come up to you, don't they? And they go, you're going to come out with us? And you go, Pum. I can't come out out. <laughs> I didn't even come out. <laughs> I only popped out. <laughs> the out out people don't want to hear this. They look at you, they go, look, you popped out. You've ended up out. <laughs> you might as well come out out. <laughs> if you've got just the right amount of alcohol in your system, you look at them, you go, you know what? I'm coming out out. <laughs> Five hours later, you're in some horrendous nightclub. Sinatra's or Cinderella's, some hellhole. <laughs> you're drunk now. And you feel you've got a crazy story for everybody. And you walk up to people. You go, do you know what? I didn't even come out. <laughs> I only popped out. <laughs> now look at me. I'm out, out. <laughs> I think the reason you feel so compelled to keep telling this rather long-winded story because you're standing there in your carpet slippers. <laughs> with a pint of milk and a cut loaf. 